you know, it's crazy because you can just tell that that's all he do. He don't do no monkeying around. He ain't got no monkey business, just an out of shape ape. Never tell this fried chicken was actually vegan. Bullshit. They look like deep fried zip ties wrapped in a coffee filter. Good Lord. The pastor must have packed and punched his arm before he threw that weighted blanket. But I tell you one thing. You throw a weighted blanket at me, the Holy Ghost ain't going to be what you worried about catching. It's going to be these hands. Hey, quick question. Um, uh, does this fall under white people shit? Okay. I, I ain't gonna front. I kind of want to pet that one. That can I pet that dog? Mixing a four loco with a twisted T. You'd have to be loco or twisted to mix it, G. You finna put yourself in a perpetual state of fucked up. Let's make something out of nothing, so brother man. Can you identify this right here? This is what we call a wish sandwich. Like, wish you had something to eat. That ain't nothing. But I am gonna need me a piece. I accidentally bought eight dozen eggs, so today I'm gonna make little scrambles. What you mean, accidentally bought eight dozen eggs? In this economy, that's a down payment on the last car of Hellcat, fam. That's a money flex. You trying to ball on us. The millennials don't seem to be aging quite like the generations before. Because we be in the crib trying to sleep off our problems. The newer generation, see, they, they're aging from them vapes and doing Fortnite dances. And then the older generation, they were smoking cigarettes at five and drinking brewskis. I don't think I've ever seen somebody run that slow, that fast. Like, if he made it out of there at that speed, bro, I would have turned into a particle accelerator. Never seen a refrigerator with a door that opens. Both you know, I've been here for 25 years and I never thought I'd see a bisexual refrigerator. That motherfucker swing both ways. Uh, she hurt you bad, didn't she, bro? I can just tell. Because, like, them was your taste buds. Now they're going to be taste enemies. You, you just sensed them like that. I don't know if I can keep doing this, bro. Yeah, I thought y'all was buddies. You gave him a bath. You just, just a. I mean, at least you kept him modest. You left his clothes on, but come on, man. On the grill. If you keep spraying all that water on there, you're just gonna put the charcoals out. Now you see, brother man, this is why you gotta mind the business that pays you. Cause right now you looking unemployed. All right, now down south we all know that that is called a smoker, mm -hmm. and it is fueled by wood. Now, if you would mind your own damn business, I think I'm going to try me a piece. Yeah, y'all might want to cool it on them priest jokes. That man finna bring that holy smoke to you, dog. The times done changed, boy. Used to have slingshots. This man got a sin-seeking missile. Oh. No, he didn't fall. <laughs> what a relief. I mean, in the beginning, the stakes were pretty high. <laughs> I'm so sorry, but I guess you could say he made the wrong move. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> oh, I'm going to stop. But like, for real though, how he even get up there? You know, it seems like every day in America, we get closer and closer to being in a GTA lobby. Like they were at a town hall meeting and somebody was like, hey, we should increase the funding for schools or fix the potholes in the road. And the dude was like, nah, I got a better idea. Brute force forklift. <laughs> Let me guess, the name of that ride is the Hell No. If not, it should be, because let me tell you something. A long time ago, I got on a ride very similar to that one. It's just a lot more stupid. Yeah, I got on it, and a little joint that's supposed to hold you down in the seat, it came up while it was moving. I held on to that thing with my little adolescent body for my life, and I still got abs for it to this day. 151, Everclear, Sambuca, Fireball, Jameson. I think the rocket launcher was the perfect name for that. That man making a cup of jet fuel, bro. Look, whoever finna drink that gonna aim for the stars and land in heaven. I love when people are like, don't say bad words. It's See, some people don't understand that cursing is an art form. And I just so happen to be a master at the craft. It's kind of like putting Tony Sashries on your food. And give it a little season, a little spice, a little pizzazz to get that kick that you want. You know, I could tell you to be quiet. But it'll never hit the same as me telling you to shut your ass up. You know, I could tell you that you being rude, or I could say that you acting like a bitch. 
And it's all about the tone. You know, the tone really gets that intensity across. Because while I could tell you, hey, could you quiet down? I could tell you to shut the fuck up with a capital F. No, this isn't a doctor with serious anger management issues in the operating room. Look, you can say the explanation, fam, okay? If I'm ever in a situation where that's necessary to take something out of my body, just leave it. And if that ain't an option, we can just cut it off. But I mean, a peg leg would be pretty nice. Just give me like a swagged out table leg, bro. I'd be the cleanest pirate on the block. Particulata. And this fruit tastes like raspberry cheesecake or raspberry yogurt. Wait a minute. Did y'all get some kind of premium past the earth or something, bro? Because I ain't never heard of these fruits. Where y'all finding this stuff at? I spent my whole life thinking that pineapples and peaches was delightful. Do y'all have one that tastes like strawberry dump cake? Because that'll hit different. Why would my landlord sit here and put this note on my door like this? Y'all must be paying rent with gold nuggets and livestock. Boy, that's an old school bounty letter right there. They getting that cash dead or alive. You might want to call the cops. I think they threatening you. Any minute now. Oh. You ever just see a person and think to yourself, man. How did they live this long? Because this brother got the survival skills of a suicide bomber, bro. You know how bad your funeral going to sound when they find out that you drowned on a slide? You said 24 on your eighth kid. Hell, I'd be mad too. With that math, they had to help raise at least two or three of them. You telling me just because you couldn't keep your legs tight that I can't sleep at night? I didn't ask for no damn babies. I've been a fan of the Tekken series my entire life, and I never knew the bot was based on a real person. This is a prime example of why you should keep your mouth closed, because you never know what somebody capable of. Shit, y'all ain't never thought about that. I almost got ten tonight is watching that. I made some Philly cheesesteak egg rolls, and they did not disappoint. They were so cheesy. You said you made a what now? Mm-hmm. Look him. You already made a magnificent meal, okay? Then you broke it in half. Well, I see the only thing left for you to do is to give me peace. This is the only way you should be making a Nashville hot chicken sandwich. <clears throat> Look here. I think somebody done told you wrong. You said make. Brother man, I'm going to take that there sandwich. Now go on, give it him. Oh, come on now, give it him. You going to make me act a fool. Give it him. I do the dishes. My wife's in the shower. And I was like, let me be a good husband. I can't even lie. I sat here for an unhealthy amount of time trying to figure out where the rest of that baby was at. That black on black is a crime, fam. I thought you had a severed baby head in your hand. He was married to his wife for 30 years until a car accident reveals who she really is. Long story short, she gets in an accident only for him to find out that her and her twin sister have been swapping places every week. Now, maybe it's just that dog with me talking, but that sounds like a win-win situation. Have you heard of lettuce chips? I can't stop eating these. They're a fun way to eat more veg. Colonizing vegetables is crazy. You realize that, right? Like you ain't do nothing extra. You ain't preheat the oven to 350. You ain't add no bacon soda, toss them in the air fryer, put no seasoning on them, nothing. Just chop them up and say lettuce chips. That's just lettuce, fam. Do it. Do it. Go. You know, the craziest part about this video isn't even the fact that she was going to try it in the first place. Or even that her friends were hyping her up to do it. It was that she was going to try to wipe the fire off her face with a hand that was already on fire. Wow. If I'm being completely transparent, I have no idea what you just said. But seven years is a long time, man. You know, you missed out on multiple once-in-a-lifetime events in that seven years. Uh... Everybody's trying to blow each other up right now. We can't get along worth nothing. Uh, and then on top of that, GTA 6 is not even done yet. If I was you, I'd just go back to sleep. You know, I think this is the first time in history that we've had a televised boss fight. And I don't even know which way it's going to go. This man, like, he put all his stats in the defense. Ah, that poor child. Well, poor children. So many lives lost. Ah, that's it. Take your time. Well, hello, dear. I think we're going to just die. Uh, take a moment of silence for you and all your fallen soldiers. You were participating in some white people shit. And it ended like some white people shit. But don't you worry, child. I'm here to guide your soul to the crossroads. I'm going to give you guys a seasoning tip 
that I learned from. Hey, forget that seasoning tip. I think you need to make sure all of them is on their last leg, cause one of them just tried to walk up out of there. What do I do? Do I just do I just pull it out? Well, I hate to be the bearer of bad news, but if they put that in the socket, it's probably a little too late for that option. But there is still adoption. Uh, Wendy's is stepping it up. This burger is big as hell. It's uh, excuse me. Who are you sleeping with at that Wendy's? Cause see, I done been there about 50 damn times. And I always give me a Baconator. But it ain't never quite look like this him. So go on tell me. I bet it is. Why don't you go ahead and bring me a piece? Drinking like some bad bitches. All I did was get a shot. I wouldn't dare be walking around with no pineapple like a bad bitch. Those sound like the words of a man who couldn't afford the pineapple drink to me. I'm gonna let you know right now, if I was there, I was gonna be the baddest bitch in attendance. Because let me tell you, I ain't spending money on nothing nasty, okay? Y'all be thinking y'all a man because you be sipping on witch hazel and coke. I'm not doing it. I'm not gonna lie, for a second there, I thought you domesticated darkness, dawg. Like Shikamaru in his prime, I was bewildered. No! No, no. 20 years from now, it's gonna be Christmas time, and you're gonna be in your living room picking up your daughter to put the star on top of the Christmas tree. And then your body's gonna send you an urgent message that says, Remember that time you was on that trampoline and you tried to throw away your leftover fries? This is a simple recipe that you can make. Did you say leftover fries no no see we eat all the fries we eat the ones in the box and the ones in the bag and if it's been five seconds we eat the ones off the floor too i just want some water bro. he turned water into wine jesus Hey man, hey man, hey man, hey man. You know how we be saying on God down in the south, we weren't talking about your dad. We we was talking about like oh for real. Like it was just to signify the significance of like what I was trying to say. Macaroni with the chicken strips. Uh, brother man, I'm about to shoot it to you straight. That don't even look that good. I mean, what's that supposed to be? Mac and cheese and chicken tenders. More like whack and cheese, if you ask me. You know what they say, though. You shouldn't judge a book by its cover, so, uh... Why don't you go ahead and let me get a piece? <laughs> he just made this man do a backflip cancel. This is unheard of. Bro tried to emote, and he unplugged the controller mid-move. Bro, that is crazy. What went wrong in your life that made you start doing stuff like that? Because you seem like you got the dietary habits of a woodpecker. Like, eating pine cone don't seem like it's out the question for you. Here's how I made some little lips for kissing worms, grasshoppers, snails, beetles. You think we want to know how? We want to know what? The hell is wrong with you? You made prosthetic pest smoochers. That's not normal civilian behavior. You must think you're some kind of love bug or something. This man done found a sacred book of backwoods. Like a black and mild brochure. Look fam, I don't know where you found that at, but I'ma need you to put it back before you get everybody smoked. All right, so I'ma let y'all know these folks gonna survive this little stunting endeavor they doing. So first off, buddy in the back with no seatbelt, he a goner. Yeah, out of there, turned him into a blade blade. You gotta be smarter than that, my man. Now the moon, this gonna negate some of that fall damage, so they should be okay because you know it's less gravity, that means you got more bounce, a lot less aggressive landing if you, or not, they turned that bitch into a boomerang and they not coming back. Now, Jupiter, this is gonna be a close, oh, you almost had it. You gotta be quicker than that. They gonna, and in other news, 47 people died today in a bush accident. Uh, Mars, I don't know too much about Mars gravity. Oh, well, I mean, y'all know where Buddy going. I'm gonna have to guide his soul to the crossroads. But the rest of them, like, they might just break a shoulder blade or something like that. But like me personally, I just not die. It's just that simple. Uh, the sun, yeah, they're through. They're through. It's gonna escalate really quickly, just like that. Mash taters, they they gone. Uh, Pluto. You know, honestly, if you're gonna die, this seems like a pretty. Pe Hold on, that man Richard going stab it. Well, he going stab it. They had to speed it up and everything. I think they gonna make it. I th oh, she. Yeah. I mean, oh, that was a very lackluster impact. I think they might pull it off. How did you even realize that that was a possibility? I mean, I, I've been on scooters plenty of times in my life, and the main thing I'm usually thinking about is not hitting my shin with it. 
But you just... You want to take my girl out on a date? I'm paying. Oh, no. Yeah, I don't know what other options there are to get wherever that road leads, but trust and believe I'm taking it, okay? In the rain, in the snow, with no shoes on. A dish soap, a sprinkler, and a trampoline could entertain your kid for over an hour. So you made a slip and slide trampoline for your kids. There wasn't no part of you that thought that maybe it wasn't a thing because it was just a terrible idea. I mean, I've heard my fair share of bad ideas in my lifetime, but this right here is different. This is like saying, fuck them kids, but in cursive. <laughs> now, y'all know I like to stay away from the politics because, you know, I want this to be a place we can all just get together and laugh regardless of the politics and all that, da 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 but Joe Biden is 167 years old. I feel like we got to have some better candidates somewhere, okay? Can we get Bill not a science guy to run for office or something? I mean, do Joe Biden even have that many years left? Fine. Can Joe Biden count to 2024? I think not. Did you just try to slide cancel into the water or were you just sanding the wrinkles off your kneecaps? Welcome to the Salty Spittoon. How tough are you? And then this kid pull up, casually standing on Legos. You know, it's people that dread that happening to him, and he just playing in them. I bet his alarm clock is just a machine to smack his shins with a scooter. That kid probably brushed his teeth with sandpaper and floss with barbed wire. He needs to be on the watch list somewhere, because he's going to be a problem. Nowadays, oh yeah, as soon as I hear that, I know the video going to be bogus. Perfect for a date night. A date night with who? Shrek and Donkey? Is she going to blow dry the meat? Hey, I like that boulder. That is a nice boulder. Now she boiling the beef. That lead to violence and depression, just like that pot right there. Now she wasting the mushrooms. I mean, I don't like mushrooms, so I'm like that slide. So it's really dry. Don't want no water. Don't want no water. Baby, I don't want no peace. That look like infant dung right there, baby shit. Doo doo, boo boo. This honey wafer ham is way cheaper. At least she saved money on the ham. This look like a World War II hot pocket. That log of mustard beef. Then she gonna wrap it up. You could have saved a wrap and just wrapped it up in a hefty Force Flakes trash bag. Half an hour and then roll it up with pastry. Make it a bit fancier. You can't make this fancy, fam. You just sometimes you gotta count your losses. Add a glaze of egg on top. This look like a science project. Degrees for twelve minutes. I know this gonna look crazy. Look at that. Yeah. They're like a Skyrim Draugr inside. Can't forget your gravy. You're gonna put them three egg beans on the plate, bro. Definitely give this one a try. Stop opening your chocolate milk like this. Instead, open it like. Oh, is that right? Well, there's one small problem. My father was a drinker, milk drinker. But me, no, no. See, I don't like milk. So, what I would do is I. Take out a knife and say, let's put a smile on that case. Who's gonna be the first to drink? <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I normally don't even like water. And before y'all say, oh, you don't drink water. No, I drink water, I just don't like it. It's nasty. It tastes like wet air. It tastes like moist inhalation. It tastes like just O2. But, um, whatever I do, they like some of that Disney water. So, uh, why don't you give me a swig? Oh, come on now, give me swig. I'm not gonna even put my lips on it. Give me swig. I hope your favorite drink is always miraculously in your refrigerator. Is this what we done came to as a society? That's what we done? Okay, well, I hope your crush takes you back quick. Yeah, I hope when he hear the word beautiful, he think of you. <laughs> I, I hope y'all get married and have a beautiful life. And when you go to sleep, I hope you have nothing but good dreams at night. Don't talk like one of them, you're not. Even if you'd like to be. To them, you're just a freak. Like me. <laughs> <laughs>